Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Lord, you are worthy. Lord, from the rising of the sun to the setting of the same, the word of God declares that your name is great and greatly to be praised. Glory to God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Good morning, good morning, good morning, everyone. Good Sunday morning. And what a beautiful day it is on today. I'm just Aaron. And guys, I just want to talk to you a little bit about uh, anxiety, about mental illness or mental health. Uh, on YouTube, I have a message up from 2012 that the Holy Spirit placed upon my heart concerning anxiety and what the Word of God has to say about anxiety. And things that we should do in order to be free from it. So uh, what I would like to do is a part three to that uh, follow up to anxiety. And this time around, I'm going to do something different. We're going to do something different here at Souls Harvest Ministry. We're going to do a Q&A, questions and answers. So guys, after you watch this video on Facebook, go into the comment section and just if you have any questions regarding anxiety, you know, make your comment known. Let me know your name. Write it down. Write your comment down. And what we're going to do is we're going to pick from those comments and we're going to air it on YouTube. We're going to answer those questions. And um, we're going to also we're going to call your name and we're going to answer those questions and we'll let you know to stay tuned to that. But uh, guys, I just want to say that mental illness is real. This is not something to uh, play around with. You know, um, you know, it's, it's very real. And uh, I just want to ask you that if you know of anyone that is suffering from this condition, you know, I want you to uh, grab some paper and a pen and, and take down this information for me, if you will, because... I believe as Christians, I believe we should not only help people spiritually, but we should help people also physically. We should be able to demonstrate the love of God in truth and in sincerity. We should be able to demonstrate the love in action, the love of God in action. So like I said, the Holy Spirit gave me this word from heaven on anxiety in 2012. And uh, he also, he spoke to my heart and said to continue to preach about anxiety. Continue to preach this message and get this message out. And he also spoke to my heart and said, he said, son, that even right now, people are being free. So let's do our part. Let's do what we can. So write this information down for me, if you will. Uh, this is the... Society is called AFSP, AFSP, and that's the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention. American Foundation for Suicide Prevention. The National Suicide Prevention Lifeline, you can contact them at 
1-800-273-8255. That's 1-800-273-TALK. Or the Crisis Text Line by texting TALK to 741741. That's 741741. You can text them by texting 741741. For one. Listen, folks, if you need someone to talk to, if you're going through depression or if you're stressed for whatever the reason may be, or if you're feeling a ton of pressure on you, please reach out to someone. Or if you know anyone that is experiencing this, reach out for them. Let us be there for people. Let us help people. Okay, again, American Foundation for Society Prevention, the National Society Prevention Lifeline. You can contact them at 1-800-273-8255. Holy Spirit, Thou art welcome in this place Holy Spirit Thou art welcome in this place Potent Father of mercy and grace, for Thou art welcome. For in thy presence there's healing divine. No other power can heal, Lord, but thine. Be empowered in Jesus' name.